What's up guys? Today we have Lille versus uh, Newcastle United on account of uh, Johan Kabai, if I'm saying that correctly, um, has uh, agreed a five-year deal with Newcastle United um, and will be a big part of their midfield next year, especially with Kevin Nolan and Joey Barton uh, on the way out from what we've heard. Um, it's uh, Kabai is a, a good player. Um, uh, has a couple caps for the French national team. Not, he's not really uh, good enough to be... Well, he's been called up a couple times as of late. Um, he's been getting better and getting a couple more call-ups here and there. Um, but uh, he's a uh, he's uh, got some decent numbers. Couple goals last year. Um, ten assists, nine assists. Sorry. Um, and uh, he's a uh, I guess you can say he's a pretty big part of Lille's success. I mean, you need a good midfield. I know they got some good front men in Jorginho and Hazard and Sao, but um. If you don't have that decent midfield there, you're not going to win a title like Lille did when they ran away with the French title. So I think you can say he's a pretty big part there. And um, he uh, said he wanted a new challenge and saying he said um, playing in the Premier League for Newcastle was obviously a step up challenge wise. Um, so. That's good. Um, it's good for Newcastle. Um, I think they've been losing a lot of players lately, or talks of a lot of players leaving. Andy Carroll left in January. Then um, got talks of Joey Barton not signing his contract, and uh, Kevin Nolan not signing his contract. So you know they they don't have too many strikers either, I guess Best is, and Amobi are kind of their two main guys up front, which I think they need more of if they're going to, um, they're going to, you know, do decent next year, um, but I think this guy, um, is most certainly going to help their midfield, um, and I think... He's, from what I've seen of him, um, I think he's better than the midfielders they've got now, or the central midfielders they've got now, I guess. He plays more out on the uh, left, I guess you can say. He can play out left, too, but um, he's more central, I guess, um, or he fits better central-wise, so... You know, if Newcastle can uh, can find a role for him in the center there, then I think he can fit. Um, Frenchmen are, uh, I don't know about tough wise. I guess they can they can be tough sometimes, and I think uh, I think he can fit in here pretty well. This is a nice goal. I'm not gonna lie to myself. Um, hazard. Um, now, now that Kabai is left, uh, you got to wonder what happens to the rest of the league. Um, I think, I think Kabai's, um, I think his transfer is going to set off that chain reaction of Lille players that we've all been waiting for, with Gervinho and Sao and um, Hazard. I think all three of them are going to go. I know Lily don't want him to go, but but I think but I guess Lily don't want him all to go. But I guess sometimes if the money's right, you can always replace those players. I know Hazard; it's going to be difficult to replace for them. And I guess Gervinho and Sao, who won a, I think won the Golden Boot in the French league. So I think. Uh, those are three pretty difficult players to uh, replace, and 
from Lily's standpoint, they're hoping that Hazard hasn't made up his mind yet, and hopefully they think Hazard will stay back at Lily for another year, and if and if that confirms, um, I think jovino has gone, period. I think jovino is going to go no matter what happens. But a lot of people and a lot of talk that, um, that, uh, Hazard is going to stay, but, um, the money's right, he may go. And I think Lille, if uh, they're hoping that if Hazard stays, Sal will stay. And you won't get as many of those people bursting off uh, and leaving so quickly. I don't think you'll get too much of that. But, um, yeah, as this game comes down to a close soon enough, um, uh, uh, goodbye. And again, I don't know if I'm saying that right. Is uh, headed to Newcastle on a five-year deal. I don't know the fee. I don't, it's an undisclosed, undisclosed fee. I'm pretty sure. So, um, to Newcastle, five-year deal. Um, and yeah, hopefully he'll uh, make the tunes a bit better. Tune army. Maybe they'll be rising back up. You never know. And uh, peace, guys. Football is an amazing game, and we've seen an amazing game of football. Until the next time. This is uh, Andy Gray and Martin Tyler saying a very goodbye to you all.